Hello and welcome. This video is a show and share 1 12th scale miniature decorating of a green leaf dollhouse kit travel trailer. It measures 23 by 8 by 9 inches assembled. Items and materials needed for the kit are listed below and shown. The kit contains pre cut wood sheets, plastic window sheet, veneer parts, dowel stick, instructions, and diagrams. Adult assistance with younger persons for assembly and decorations is needed. The travel trailer has two large access locations, one from the top and one from one side. It's easy to modify. I made a number of changes including the door to the other side and opted not to have the vendor awning. There is plenty of room for a living area, computer area, kitchen, dining, bed and bath. I made a rooftop cover and used the same fabric for the ceiling that I used for the walls on the inside. I added treads to the stair steps and I made my travel trailer a removable hitch and wheels. For exterior decorations and reflector lights, I used bits and pieces from red and orange pen and pencil canister tubes. For the wheels, I glued a one inch circle cardstock piece with a silver circle surrounded by eight seed beads. I added a cloth awning to the open side. It's about nine by two inches and the height of the poles are seven inches and it's in a semi rolled up piece around a dowel. In the back of the mini travel home, I added a removable wall divider between the bed and bath. It is six and a half inches by three and a quarter and curved to fit the wall. The bathroom has a shower, sink, and toilet. I'm working on indirect lighting of the travel trailer. It's still a little bit dark, so I think I'm going to add some more LED lamps to the side, to the front, and above the dining room table. I landscaped a 30 by 20 by one inch piece of foam board for the mini travel home display. First, I made a nine inch by 30 inch drive on an angle. Then I made random size circles and oval shapes in the shape of pebbles with clear brown and gray glass paint. When that was dry, I painted a light gray top coat. Then I used textured yarn glued in wavy rows when that was dry, I dabbed it with kiwi green paint, randomly. I used a variety of materials on the inside. I chose a tan wood grain look fabric for the walls and the ceiling because of its flexibility. I used faux suede light browns for the flooring, couch, and the bed. I put a clear plastic tile sheet over top of the suede for the kitchen, dining, hall, and the bath area. I use wood craft pieces painted with silver beads and handles for the drawers and the cupboards. The couch and the bed are six and a half by three inches. I printed from printmini.com's website mini electric switch and plug plates, as well as the tissue boxes. I have purchased several items for the travel trailer home, including the dining chairs, computer stool, Chris and Bond dining room light, coffee pot, and cooking pan. Some of the other accessories I have made in previous videos, including the juicer blender, bungee cord, honeycomb candles, kale, celery, beehives, honey bottle, tote and bucket, apple slices, Queen Anne's lace, dandelions, clover, and brown-eyed Susans in the wildflowers. The kit took me about 12 hours over several weeks to complete. The clear directions, diagrams, recommendations, and suggestions were helpful and made the assembly process enjoyable. I love the kit. Yes, I made the visiting Sasquatch who brought his cat friend. I hope you like and share the ideas from this 112 scale mini travel trailer kit. Thank you so much for watching.